Got it. Very okay. good. Uh, yeah. So basically, it uh, talks about Matthew 13, 44. Uh, and it's where Jesus talks about the kingdom of heaven being like a treasure hidden in a field. And so this guy comes along, he finds the treasure, digs the whole thing up, and he wants it so bad that in his joy, he's like all fired up about it. So he goes and he sells everything he has so he can buy this field and have this treasure. And so basically what we talked about was kind of asking the question, what is the kingdom of heaven to you? Like this life of Jesus, is it a treasure to you? Is it a burden? Is it an obligation? Um, is it something that you find life-giving? Um, and if it's not, and that's not your treasure, then really what is? Like, what is it that you're kind of seeking after with your life? Is it, uh, success? Is it, you know, reputation? Like, like what are those things? Um, then I told this other story that at times may have been mildly funny, and then at other times wasn't funny at all, but uh, about uh, just kind of my career in writing and having to do some really awkward things along the way, uh, and then eventually ending up in Kansas and having this conversation with this girl who just lost her mom. Um, and that was kind of a moment for me where I kind of discovered, like, that it wasn't all about success and wasn't all about achieving, but it was about these kind of down, dirty moments with, with broken people. So you brought us a message, obviously from scripture and from experience in your life of what the kingdom really is all about. Yeah. What would be your hope um, for us as a GCU community in terms of practice or applying yeah. the stuff that you told us? Yeah. yeah. Man, I guess when I think, man, what, what, would be, uh, what would be my hope for the GCU community in terms of that? You know, idea that we were thinking about, I guess it would just be the people would first and foremost be willing to just be honest about where they're at in that whole kingdom conversation and is it your treasure and is it not? Because I feel like my tendency is to pretend and like, oh yeah, of course that's the most important thing to me, uh, even though it's not. And then I think from there, um, well, let's just leave it right there and maybe just to be honest about the answer and then go from there where you need to go.